Hello everybody and welcome to Great Games Live Plays the Hits, the series where I play through some of the very best video games of all time. And today I will be taking on the Arcane Studios classic Dishonored. So without further ado, let's go for it. Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send so that you could remain near. But there is no one else. And the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Here's the fly. Passing off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Like black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague. Well, hello everyone and welcome to Dishonored. Now, this is an absolutely wonderful game and I cannot wait to show it to you. If I could get off this boat, there we go, we can jump off there. Um, yes, we are playing as Corvo Atano. And we are going to see the Empress. Let's see what we have to do here. Hello, sir. Tell me about your trip, please. Were there any whales? Wait, let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, go on. I have important news for the Empress, but I'm sure I can take time out to have a game of hide and seek. That seems like something that would happen. But anyway, yes, let's play. Okay, here we go. All right, so what have we got to do, Emily? Follow me, Corvo. Yes, I'm following. Don't worry. Right, what are we doing, Let's Emily? see if you're so good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. I know how okay, hide and seek works. I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. All right, close your eyes. No cheating. Stealth. Press B to enter stealth mode, then stay behind cover to break line of sight with enemies and avoid detection. While sneaking, your footsteps are muffled. Okay. So, there we go. I'm into stealth mode. Make sure you're not cheating, One, Emily. I know two, you. Three, four, now, I think five, if I hide behind here, six, I should be safe. Seven, it should be an obvious hiding spot, but I don't think she looks here. She might. She might. Not sure you will. Ah, you haven't found me yet, have you? Okay, you win. We should go now. Some other can see you too. Uh, 
possibly the worst hide and seek player I think I've ever seen. Absolutely oh. ridiculous. Anywho. While you were gone, Mother seemed very sad. I think she missed you. I'm not surprised. I'm awesome. Oh, hello. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Hello. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. I don't think it's too bad likeness, actually, but there we are. I'm no artist. Hello, Anton Sokolov. Um, I didn't mean to jump next to you. I meant to talk to you. Here we Show go. Show my improvements to the waterlock. Uh, yes, it was great. Thank you. I thought you were going to sort of speak a little bit more there, but apparently not. Hello, hi, Overseer Campbell. How are you? It was a fool's errand, Corvo. The plague comes from inside us. We must all strengthen our faith. Okay. Hi, Overseer. I must ask you to hold your pose. Yes, for goodness sake, hold your pose, High Overseer. Hello. She'll see you at once. Absolutely. Let's go up and find out what is happening. I don't know why the game's asking me to sprint everywhere. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Look at this guy. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. Something tells me he's up to no good. But let's find out. Hello, Empress Jessamine. Fantastic Follow name me, you've got Captain. there. It's a fair wind that brings you, you home to me. Alone. What news have you brought? How do I give the letter? I just jumped in front of you. That seems weird. How do I give you the letter? Uh, there we go. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. Knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. That doesn't sound Cowards. too good. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Where are Mother, the guards? Look. What are they doing on the rooftop? Hold up. What? Emily, come here. Combat. Press RT to attack with your right hand or LT to attack with your left hand if you have a weapon or power equipped. Uh, okay, so. Emily, get behind me. I'm trying to defend myself because I'm playing this game on what is known as low chaos. And what that basically means is I don't really want to kill anyone. I will explain that more in a bit. Okay, we did it. Corvo, thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Oh, oh, mommy! Oh. Get away! Corvo! Corvo. It's all coming apart. Fine. Find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Take him.
This is your final chance, Grovo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this. Even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. Guards! Take him back to his cell. Should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. And we are back. Now, I should mention, um, when I was fighting those guys earlier, before the Empress was killed, uh, I did mention something called Chaos, and there's a Chaos system in this game. Um, and if you play the game in High Chaos, it means you're sort of killing everyone in sight, and doing all sorts of dastardly deeds and um, that basically affects what happens in the game. If you play the game in low chaos you're sort of um, you're not killing anyone, you're trying to remain as stealthy as possible and uh, and so on and so forth. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna play in low chaos which is why I was simply protecting myself earlier rather than killing the people who were attacking the Empress and uh, yes, so just to let you know, that's how I'll be playing the game. I'm going to try and be a super stealthy, and I'm going to try not to kill anyone. That's what I'm going to be doing. Anyway, let's get Corvo out of this prison, shall we? Here we go. I'm going to read this bread. <gasps> there is a note underneath, an anonymous message. Let's read it. Corvo, who we are is irrelevant right now. Just know that we have faith in you. Here is the key to your cell. Once you're out, head for the prison's interrogation room. Take the explosive there and plant it on the outer door. When the bomb goes off, run! Make for the river and lose yourself in the sewers. You'll find some useful gear stashed there. One of the prison guards will leave a weapon just outside your cell. And good luck. We need you alive and well for what's to come. Signed, a friend. Well, that's good. And we've got a cell key. Can I buy your ration of elixir from today? Please, not now. And we're out. Straight into stealth mode. Can I... I can't close it again. Okay, that's fine. Okay, just leaving a sword out on the table. That's fine. I'm going to take it, but I'm not really going to be killing anyone, so that's fine. Um, right, let's see what we're dealing with here. So many people are coming to the execution tomorrow. We have guards. There are guards. It's on account of Corvo. Um, who killed the Empress right. and abducted her daughter, Emily. Now I've got to try and remember how to do this. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the High and Mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. That ain't gonna happen. They're as bad as us betting on the dogfights. Okay, so, if I remember correctly, Attention. I can take this guy out. Here we go. Assassinations and non-lethal takedowns. With a sword in hand, assassinate an unaware enemy by pressing RT or approach an unaware enemy from behind and hold RB to perform a non-lethal takedown. Using stealth and the non-lethal approach has benefits. Fewer rats and weepers. Some people react favourably and the final outcome is not as dark. That's what I mean about the chaos system. If you play in low chaos, then there are fewer plague rats around, there are fewer weepers, which are sort of um, plague victims in this game, and they do attack you, and um, and also the ending of the game isn't quite as dark as it would be otherwise. Um, and that is how we're going to play. So, without further ado, let's try and take this guy out. Unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. And carry you. The solitary now, must be scheduled in advance with other people can notice. see um, unconscious bodies. 
if you just leave them lying around willy-nilly in the open and then they're on their guard so what I'm going to try and do is hide them away hopefully the other guy will just stay away there we are nice and easy and run away run away get back to your cell Corvo drop him in going in and we've got it fantastic right off we pop well that's not a bad start is it not a bad start at all attention the solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews unless accompanied Ooh, we've got by a gun not that i need it but i'll pick it up why not uh, let's put the weapon away that's okay Okay, climb up. Boom. Tin of brined hagfish. Tin of potted whale meat. Sokolov's health elixir. Picking up all the items. People just leave their coins lying around in this game. It seems silly to me. But who am I to question the developers on this? Lovely, lovely money. I don't know why I'm eating stuff, I'm at full health, but you know. Okay, one of the things that you can do in this game is you can hold a button to look through the keyhole. And as you can see, there's a man waiting there for us with a key on their belt. The Lord only knows what that key opens. But let's let's go inside and take them out. We got him. We got him. Lovely stuff. Uh, I'm going to pop him just down there. That's fine. And close the door. Uh, preferably with me on the other side. What are you doing, Corvo? Some more coins just lying around. That's perfect. Okay. Right. So I think I've got the yard walkway key. And I've got to be careful because there's probably, probably some guards hanging around. No, don't do that. Now there is a lean mechanic in this game. I love a good lean mechanic if you hold the Y button as it turns out. And you can lean and lean the other way. And it means people can't see you while you're doing that as well. So you can just sort of poke your head around corners. Very useful. By an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must it's be gonna... scheduled in advance. Oh, there's a dude one there. Right, let's go for it. Come on, Corvo. Come on, Corvo. You can do it. You can do it. Got him. Okay. This is pretty decent stealthing at the moment. Now, those are famous last words. I'm bound to be spotted soon. Okay, the yard's that way, but I've got to go into the interrogation room. Let's see what's what. Look through the keyhole. Doesn't look like there's anyone around. In we go. Let's close the door behind us. All right. Let's pick up the explosive. It's just through here. We'll see if there's anything else. Here we are. Lovely. Let's close the safe. You know, no one was ever here. Uh, apart from all the missing coins. Anything else here? No? Okay. Let's make our way out. Now, what's this? What's all this? Oh, some more coinage. We will take it. Duty officer's report. I might as well read it. Duty officer's report. Corvo's interrogation. Corvo Atano, formerly the Royal Protector, will be brought in for interrogation. This is of utmost importance. The Lord Regent and High Overseer Campbell will conduct the questioning themselves. Follow their orders without hesitation and keep the torturer under control. If Corvo dies in his hands, instead of getting the public execution the Lord Regent wants, it'll be your head that rolls next. Okie dokie. And what's this? Corvo's unconscious again. Though he's taken more punishment than the two men we brought in for interrogation. When he wakes, we'll start again. Having him sign the confession for her murder isn't critical, 
but it might be useful to us later. The assassination of an empress is not a trivial matter. Hmm. Okie dokie. There's no way I'm signing confessions. I'm out of here. Wah! Oh, thank goodness for that. Thought I was going to get spotted for a second. Leaning around corners. Well, I know the lean mechanic, but that's fine. By holding Y and then pressing left or right on the left stick, you can lean around corners, allowing, to you, allowing you to look ahead without being seen by enemies. Well, I've explained that already, but uh, thank you for reminding me, game. Can I... Hold up. Yes, can I... There we go, thank you. Lazy slug. Did you patrol the yard? Sorry, not yet. I was gonna report that boiler leak from yesterday. Forget it. Just do your rounds. The report's trouble for both of us. I'm moving. Just gonna sneak around these guys, I think. There's, this guy's got a key on his belt. Um. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews. Unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Hey, escort. Don't you owe me a drink? Okay, let me sneak round here. I'm going to try and get up the stairs. Hold on, let's have a lean. Okay, up we go. Run, Corvo, run. Good job. Oh dear. execution is tomorrow, right? Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his hand roll. Not everyone did. I really like the Empress. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can do in here. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, I'm going to leave him there. Okay, he's coming back. I'm just going to hide around here for a second. Ooh, more coins! Ah! Don't jump! Don't jump, Corvo. Oh, good lord. I might stop me here. Attention. The solitary should I, wing should is I try and take him out? Oh my goodness, that was almost a wall. disaster, but Escort I got him. Through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Okay, we are going to pop you down here. Right. Now, I believe, if I remember correctly, there's another guard. Possibly through this door. Let's have a look through the keyhole. There they are. Now. <coughs> shall I go for it? Shall I go for it? That is the big question. Oh no, they've turned around. <coughs> Hello. As soon as he turns around and walks away again, I'm going to get out of there. Uh, and I'm going to take him out. <coughs> Sounds like they need a throat lozenge. Okay, here we go. And you're down. Fantastic. So, we are on our way to getting out of here. Well on our way. Let's pick up some more coins and some of that stuff. Uh, let's open that door. And go like that. Now, if I remember correctly, there's some more guys in the next room. Let's see, shall we? Uh, yes. How do I open up that door? Let's open up this door. There we go. That's an exceedingly loud door. I was hoping for something where the hinges had been oiled slightly better than that. Okay, we've got another guard up the top there. Let's... Oh, and another guy here. Oh, my goodness me. Okay. Can I... There's a guy up there at the top. Okay, let's take this dude out. Nothing happened. No one was here. Nothing happened at all. Your friend has just gone for a little break. That's all. That's all. Okay, I'm going to close that door and do another lean out. 
Okay, rock and roll. This isn't going terribly so far, I must say, considering uh, it's been all stealth. Okay, it's turned around, I think, up there. Shall I go for it? Mm, go on. Mm, this may be an error. This may be an error of judgment. Gotta bring the noise. Do not turn around, do not turn around, do not turn around. Got you! Good grief! Okay, I am going to pop him back here now. Okay, it is time to place the explosive on the outer door and get out of this place. Now, when I do this, a whole bunch of guards are going to come in here. So I've got to find somewhere to hide. Luckily, there's this little sort of dog cage here, wolfhound cage. And that is what I'll be using to hide. So, plant the bomb, run into here, turn around, and wait for everything to happen. There we go. go. We should have a bunch of guards coming in shortly. Well, you haven't found me yet. That's fine. Where are you? Really? I thought they'd come running to the door, but apparently not. I might just go for it. And I'm out. I am out of Coldridge Prison. Absolutely thrilled with that effort. Let's get to the sewer. And get out of here, for goodness sake. Lovely stuff. We are in the sewers. Now, we've just got to work out what we're going to do next. Not a bad start to say the least and I cannot wait to play some more of this wonderful game. Thank you all for watching. I very much appreciate it and I hope I'll see you again in the next video. Bye bye everybody.